Hi guys, very very quick one. Um, sorry for the noise in the background. That is the heater. It is December, and it's freezing in here. Um, but it's too cold to get the bike out because I'm a wuss, and it's been raining all day. And then a very nice delivery man turned up, and some things arrived. So. From this, you're probably going to guess, um, based on the previous videos, that we're going to go with building something. So, um, I'm still going to test ride a new 1200 Scrambler, 2020-2021 model. Um, but, looks like we're going to build something, and build something pretty special. So, I uh, got these parts for an amazingly good price. And, uh... I've been waiting for them to turn up for the past couple of days and thought I'd do a quick unwrap. It's not really an unboxing, unwrapping um, for the channel. Um, so it'll be Sunday when this is going up. I'm also going tomorrow morning for you guys, uh, on Monday morning, to look at a 2006 Carbretta Scrambler. Um, fairly local to me so I'll film the, the rundown of that and you guys should see that on Thursday so yeah gonna go down take a good look go with my dad as well um, you'll see something very interesting that he's got um, might see if he'll do a bit swap and I'll do a ride along on that um, I was gonna save that bike for next summer but you'll get to see a sneak preview of it in advance of that um, but yeah so let's see what we got in here eh? be very careful with the blade um yeah let's take a nosey so so we're gonna take a uh take an early well last of the car breath uh 865 270 degree crank scrambler we're gonna put a slightly lower slung exhaust on it's more more for a b-road bike um but also gonna use it quite extensive for the channel seems daft that I'm uh, this soon in and, and building a bike just to record these videos on but the Harley's a bit too loud and Cluxton's not really comfortable and the BSA you can never rely on it so let's build something okay um, I want you guys along for for the build so we're going to take a say 2006 scrambler or somewhere around that let's see if we'll buy this one and we're going to put a new front end on it new rear shocks jack it up strip it down get as much weight off it as we can and uh yeah see what we end up with so first packet is a complete set of handlebars aluminium pro tape of handlebars complete with the switch gear and the master cylinder from a Triumph 800XC. Let's get some of this rubbish out of the way. Sorry for the uh, mess in front of you. So, yeah, these were particularly cheap. Let's turn them around to the correct view. Point, eh? Sorry, the camera angles are all over the place. Um, I should have an overhead camera, but it seems I didn't charge the battery. Don't tell anybody. Um, these have come with fully adjustable, genuine Triumph levers. And you can see that. Genuine Triumph aluminium levers. The wing guards. Genuine Triumph Pro Taper with lovely Triumph logo on there. Complete with the switch gear, throttle housing, the bar ends, the brake lines, but we'll probably change those for, for braided lines. Uh, and a lovely little dribble of brake fluid in my laptop bag, that's nice. Um, yeah, complete set. So, that's the first, the first little packet that arrived. I'll just drop these over here near the throttle. 
that's also crank cases from a BSA engine we're going to rebuild so you'll probably be seeing quite a bit of that as well now what we got in here a little flash of gold there so right, before I open this in this box lovely little company pyramid parts they're on eBay use them got these bearings in the BSA I've used them in four or five bikes now never had an issue and they these guys kindly based on size spec did me a set of tape roller bearings that will convert what I believe is in this packet to fit on the early bonnet frame Nice set of headstock bearings there. Have we uh, get this table in here? Yes. Oh, yes. So yeah, complete with the spindle and the wheel spacers in pretty good nick. A little bit of pit in there, but nothing anywhere near here. Dust seals are in good nick. But those are going to be absolutely brilliant. So yeah. You can see that. Very happy with those. So, I'll leave those on the beach. This is a very quick and dirty, rough edit video. I do apologise. See what's in here. I completely forgot what I ordered to be honest. I knew about the, the handlebars and the uh, fork with the yolks, which I think are pretty tasty. And, um, yeah. What is in here? That looks like a brake fitting, doesn't it? Hmm. I know what's in here. Be careful. I don't know it's mine, man. I think this. Uh -huh. Yes, it is. Aha. Uh -huh. This is a nice pair of reasonable condition matching brake calipers to suit these forks my hope is to do ABS delete on these I need to do a bit of or is that just a wheel speed since it's been yeah I don't think they're ABS calipers they might be Either way, they're, uh, they're in pretty good nick by the looks of it. More rubbish. And then, what's in here? So you guys can see what I can see. I honestly don't know what's in this one. Sounds like an expensive amount of stuff. Mm. That well, whatever it is. Oh, 
Oh, did I order? Just a, a tub to put all the random bolts and fixings in. Looks like an old broken sump or some description. <laughs> Probably the sump off the edge. <laughs> yeah, it's just random bolts and things. So, but within here is the stock riser kit. That's what I asked for. The old bearing. And a race. I assume the caliper bolts are probably in there as well. Oops. Ah! Okay, that's what I wanted, that's going to need some cleaning of this. Yeah, he said these would be in here. Probably going to have to replace that, that's not in the best nick. Shims. The upper bearing by the looks of it. Sorry, camera died. Thursday video will follow with me going to look at this 2006 Scrambler uh, and some general thoughts plus a few little treats in there. Um, and then following on from that, whenever any other bits turn up, we'll, uh, I'll update you as, as we go. Um, other than that, it's good to see, uh, I wanted to add a footnote, Chase on two wheels, his channel is back up and running, he's live again, he's got video coming out today, he's had a couple of videos uh, yesterday, so uh, yeah, it's good to see him back in full swing, get over there, support him, and uh, take it easy.